Live in today, and do not allow yourself to live in the past under any pretense. Living the past means thinking about the past, rehearsing past events, especially if you do this with feeling. Train yourself to be a man or a woman who lives one day at a time. You'll be surprised how rapidly conditions will change for the better when you approach this ideal. Emmett Fox One of the truths of living on the spiritual basis is the only time that we can be present for God, the only time we can stand in the presence of God, the only time that we can demonstrate God's love and guidance in our lives is in the present moment. We may have a long history of Him demonstrating in our life, but our forgetter discounts it. Fear would have us believe that even though God was there yesterday, He won't be here today or tomorrow. So never look back. Looking back generally begins innocently enough, but often leads into morbid reflection. Think on how easy it is to dredge up memories of those times when we were something less than spiritual, or we were hurt in some way. Yet it takes effort to bring to the forefront of memory those times when we acted in spirit, or life went our way. When the great carpenter taught, let the dead bury the dead, he admonished us to leave the past in the past. We are forgiven as soon as we ask. The matter settled. Yet so often we drag past transgressions into the present to cast their ashes about, because even though God has forgiven us, we have not forgiven ourselves. Only by living in today and keeping our eyes fixed on the road ahead, regardless of how frightening it may seem, can we demonstrate God's love and power in our life, demonstrating the truth of God's forgiveness. Refuse then the clarion call of the past where fear, the adversary of a thousand faces lurks, and be free. My name is Vincent Lee Jones. You can find my writings at Blogger, title of the page, Living in Spirit, my videos on both Facebook and YouTube, at Vincent Lee Jones, and the James Club as well on Facebook. Have a blessed day.